UK Prime Minister David Cameron has expressed concern following reports that leading oil companies may be involved in price fixing. Early stage inquiries are underway following raids on the offices of BP, Shell and Statoil, a Norwegian company, by the European Commission. The news has angered some motorists as there has been a rise in petrol prices in the last few months. I think all of London would like to see um, the petrol rises lowered. Certainly they ones that use petrol for work. Because the, the cost of fuel comes straight out of my pocket, it, it, I can't put the fares up. The fares are set regularly by TfL. So any money just comes straight out of my income. Any, anything I pay out comes straight out of my income. Member of Parliament Robert Halfon has called on the UK Office of Fair Trading to thoroughly investigate price-fixing claims. Last year I raised this in the House of Commons. I tabled a motion urging the Office of Fair Trading to look into all these issues which had been raised to us by a whistleblower from the city who, who suggested that the oil market was being manipulated and we have heard the OFT did an investigation but they did a partial investigation. I call it a lettuce leaf, limp-wristed investigation for over a few weeks rather than the year 18 months and it should have been and I think the OFT have been found wanting and it's a shame that we've had to rely on the European Union to actually do this work when it should have been done by our own institutions. If uh, any illegality has taken place, then the people who have uh, done wrong should go before the courts. I mean, it's as simple as that. We don't know if anything's uh, been done incorrectly or illegally, but the investigation needs to take place. All those responsible, if found guilty, should face prison sentences. My view is there should be prison for price fixing. Simple as that. If they were fixed, then I think then uh, the government and the regulators should do something about it. Um, put a formula in place so that uh, they can check what the right market price is, perhaps what an acceptable margin is, and then give them guidance on what sort of prices should be charged. It would be uh, rather irritating. It's more the fact that no one's actually figured it out previously, that they, they, they have been fixed. Um, so that would be more frustrating that actually it hasn't been found, found out beforehand. So I'm sure people would have known if it has been fixed. Although the inquiry into price fixing is in its early stages, Mr Cameron has insisted that legislation brought in after the LIBOR rate fixing scandal could be applied to the oil market. Oil companies like BP and Shell say they are working with the authorities to help them with their inquiries. This is Celestina Ololode for JN1 in London.